Hey everybody, welcome back to Supercard. It is 8 o'clock in the morning. I just got home from work, and so I just wanted to record something quickly. This isn't going to be, well, this part I'm recording right now is not going to be the whole video. I'm just doing this part right now. Um, you can see I just got home from work, you know, transport services, still even got my ID badge. So, yeah. I want to talk about this first. Starting next week, we're celebrating WrestleMania season in a big way with three 48-hour Flash events featuring WrestleMania favorites and some of the superstars and divas appearing at WrestleMania 32. Check the blog for more. So, we already know John Cena is the ring domination card. Quite frankly, I'm surprised Cat Daddy was able to go this long into Supercard for season two without a Cena event. And that Cena card is good. Like, He's a very powerful card, so I will be going for that one for Ring Domination. And then it's going to be PCC at the end of the week with Roman Reigns and Triple H. There's going to be, The only way to get that pro, though, you have to rank high in PCC. We don't know how high yet, but uh, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm sitting out that PCC because WrestleMania tier is going to come out like the next day. So, as you see, we did get to the finals. We ended up winning, so yeah, that was cool. I'm trying to. I want to go back to the to the semifinals. Is it gonna let me? Whatever. I'm just gonna open up the contenders bracket. We'll look at this here. So yep, yeah, there's me as the champion. So this guy here, the guy who I beat in the semis. So you saw I beat him two straight. And oh, you can't. Uh, or can I? If I go to schedule, can I see what the win loss was for King of the Ring? Mine wasn't that great, but that's because, like, I just wanted to qualify, that's it. If I can find that guy that I beat, you can see he only got two losses, <laughs> so they were against me. <clears throat> see, he went undefeated all the way till he played me in the brackets, and I like doing that to people when they, they you know, they're like, I went 45-0, and 0, I'm going to breeze through to the finals and then someone like me beats them. Uh, I like doing that to people, I don't like when people do it to me, so... Really, um, I don't care what the rewards are, except for the legendary one. I want Bailey just so I can finish the legendary catalog. Um, you know, maybe Undertaker or Brock Lesnar I wouldn't mind getting for the Survivor. We are getting a Dolph Ziggler. That makes a pro. That's about as excited as I'm going to be. Oh, I saw a Diva and I thought it was Bailey. Okay, so crap reward. That Dolph Ziggler makes a pro. Not one that I can really use, but anyways, that's going to be it for right now, and I will be right back. Hey everybody, welcome back to the rest of the video. So, we're 10 points away. I was at a work party um, tonight, we went to some uh, wing bars, so... I've had a lot to drink. It makes up, I guess, for St. Patrick's Day. So... <laughs> Hopefully we can get this done in, uh, in one go. It's around 11.30 at night. I've been drinking since um, 6.30. That's just, um, that's just the work stuff, so we'll get this through. So at the beginning of this video, I was talking about how we have all these flash events coming up. We've got the, what's it called? We've got the Ring Domination coming up on Monday. And then the Road to Glory to make the pro of that card. And then we've got that uh, PCC. So, they spoke about them. They said they're going to be flash events. So that they're only going to be 48 hours. So, I don't know how this is going to work for People's Champion. Uh, not P People's Champion. Ring Domination. If they're going to make a flash 48-hour event for Ring Domination, um, I don't think it should be the, th you know, if you're, I'm Survivor tier, so I don't know, I don't think it's going to be the Legendary, the Survivor, then the event card. Excuse me. With the, with it being a event card, or just any event really, I think it's going to be... I'm hoping at least it's going to be just the event card that you do because with 48 hours there is no possible way 
that you can finish Road to Glory, uh, not Road to Glory, Ring Domination for free within 48 hours. Like, I shouldn't say it like that. It is possible, but that means pretty much you need to get a shard every single turn to be able to finish a Road to Glory within 48 hours if you're doing three cards. With two, maybe. If you don't really sleep, make sure you play every bout. But for free, I don't think it's possible that you can uh, finish Ring Domination like that. So, if it is that you have to pay for bouts, doublers, believe me, like, well, not believe me, trust me, I'm going for that Cena card, that Cena event card that they're offering. In almost three out of the four stats against every single event card, that Cena beats. That's a very good card. That John Cena is going to be impressive. It's going to help you out, even though with all these Flash events happening, we know WrestleMania tier is coming next week. Like, otherwise, why else would they do a Road to Glory? I keep getting mixed up. Ring Domination, Road to Glory, and PCC in the same week. It's kind of like they're just pushing out these Survivor event cards just so they can get them out before the WrestleMania tier starts. So I'm going to be going for that Ring Domination card for the John Cena because the stats are fantastic. I'm not going to lie. And it will help me out for the beginning of WrestleMania tier. Um, with this PCC coming up with Roman Reigns and Triple H, um, I just, I don't see myself pushing hard for that. Mainly because I would like to take a few days off from this game, and PCC is the perfect time to take some time off from this game. It's the easiest time to take off because, you know, it goes from... Thursday morning to Sunday night. That's four days, like any other event. It's the perfect time to take off because you've got all this time off now. Like, that's... PCC is the one event that you need to cons consistently play in order to get the event card, whether it... Well, not whether it be the pro, but you need it for the single. The only way to make that Triple H or Roman Reigns a pro from this PCC is you got to rank high enough. If it's going to be you need to rank in the top 200, screw it. I'm not doing it. If it's, you know, top 2150, maybe I'll try for it, but that's about it because I know... And I'm sure a lot of us know, WrestleMania tier is coming right after these events are done. That's uh, that's how it's going to be, and then I'm sure the fusions will come out as well. So that's my plan for that. I'll at least get the John Cena, because it can tag with the Kalisto perfectly. Kalisto is toughness speed. John is power charisma. It covers every single stat. It's like in Season 1, when I ran the... Road to Glory, Kane, and Seth Rollins. <coughs> Excuse me. Road to Glory, Kane, and Seth Rollins tag team. Kane would cover the power and toughness. Seth Rollins would cover the speed and charisma. It's a very good matchup. And that John Cena is a, it's a very powerful card. I'm not going to lie. The stats are just absolutely insane on that card. But anyways, I'm going to go play some Rocket League and drink the rest of my tea hopefully I can kind of calm this um, I'm gonna say this is is a fantastic buzz not a drunk a fantastic buzz hopefully I can calm this down before I go to sleep but anyways that's gonna be it for the rest of the day thank you all for watching please take care